Hello guys, uh, welcome back to Code with Maddy. And in this video, we are going to learn a binary search uh, DSA part in a Python. Okay. Uh, firstly, uh, binary search to uh, perform a binary search, uh, we need a list. Uh, that list elements should be in a sorted format. Unsorted list can uh, we cannot perform a binary search on a uh, unsorted list. Okay. The the first thing is we'll take array. Uh, uh, that is list. Uh, it, the element should be in sorted format 10, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70. Okay. And uh, we'll take another variable that is value which we want to search in the given list. Okay. I want to search value 40. I want to search the index of uh, 40. Okay. After that, we'll store the result answer or answer in a variable okay and i'll pass binary binary okay search i'll call the method and uh, i'll pass the array i'll pass the uh first position that is zero and the length of the array that is minus one the alien of array minus one and the value which i want to find in the given list okay after that we'll check whether given the result is equal to minus one means the means we have to print that the element the given value the given value is not present in the the given value the given value okay the given value is not present in the in the the list okay dot format x or oh, not x this is value if the value is present we have to print that value and the index of the the given value given value is the given value is is present present in the the given value is present in the list okay given value this is value present in the list at index at index okay this is dot format the value the given value that is value and the result answer where it is present okay this is we have completed the uh, input part we will now create a method or a function that is binary 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 underscore search and these are the arguments array left left is zero and the right is the length of gst and the value which we want to search in the list okay firstly we'll check that whether the this length this uh, right most length is greater than or equal to this is this right is greater than equal to then only it should uh, uh the condition comes to be true if it is uh right is greater than left okay if it is true then we we will find the middle value using this left plus right minus right minus left divided by two okay first we'll find the mid we'll check whether mid is equal to given value mid is equal to given value then it should return mid or not here it is not mid it should be array of mid okay because we are finding the uh, element uh, if it if this condition uh, comes true then it should return middle value uh, middle uh, index of the middle value okay next condition that is uh, elif elif if uh, elif array of mid is greater than 
greater than x if it is greater than or greater than value okay if it is greater than value then it, the value should be searched uh, uh, from the uh, left to mid minus one okay that time we'll use this we, we will use here a recursion that is binary search binary search array will pass in this array then we'll pass left then we'll pass mid minus one because array is uh, mid is not uh, mid is greater than well, given value then it should search from the mid minus one to left left hand side okay then we'll pass in this value otherwise if array of mid is less than equal to given value then it should uh, search in uh, here we don't need to uh, write a condition because if this both condition comes out to be false then it should go to the else part so the last condition remains that is uh, array is array array of mid is less than equal to value then it should return not return it should uh, come to the uh, rightmost part of the array and it should search okay array then we'll pass here mid plus one then we'll pass right then we'll pass the value okay this will be did the uh, binary search if this condition comes out to be false then it should return the in else condition it should return minus one okay uh, we'll try to run and we'll check that whether we have uh, written up uh, right code or not i want to search uh, this 40 uh, the index of this uh, number is uh, 0 1 2 3 okay it is present at third index we'll check whether it is correct or not oh sorry we have made value name value sorry here i made a mistake somewhere yes value again i'll run oh map map dot format line for presenting thing okay i'll pass the one argument okay uh region presenting the top line number 25 Oh, oh, let me see this. Oh, oh, sorry, 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 sorry. I here made a map. It should be format. Mm, yes, okay. The value. Value. Okay, comma is. Yes. Uh, let's run. The given value is present and the list present in the list, and we have to return the index sorry the given value is present in the list at index 3 now i'll search for the 70 it should return 6 let's run the given value is present in the list at index 6 we have got the correct output and this is the uh we can find using recursion instead of uh, using for loop we have to check where we have to check that whether it is uh, there or not then when uh, now i'll pass the value which is not present in the list then it should return uh, the value is not not present in the list oh return sorry i made some spelling mistake here okay the given value it is not present in the list okay this was the binary search code we can uh have a look uh also i'll put this uh a binary search in the description box uh you can copy from there okay thank you